Hey family, how are you? What a joy, what a privilege to be able to gather uh, again to see you, that you may even see me. <laughs> um, I, I'm excited about what we have been studying uh, out of the Epistle of John. And we had a portion of John, verses 12 to about verse 14, where he tells us those that are a part of the family of God fall in one of three categories. You are either a father, mother in the faith. You're either a young man, young woman in the faith, or you're either a child in the faith. We have discovered that each one of those levels, starting at childhood, babe in Christ, at that level, you're there because you're supposed to be there. You're there because just like you are born naturally, you don't come out talking, singing, and walking. You're a baby. You have desires for the Word of God, which helps your development as a child of God. Then we looked at this week and last week, the adolescent stage or the stage that's after babyhood or childhood young men, young women, in which John speaks to. He says this stage causes them to experience some level of success because they know more about the wicked one. They, are be they have become strong because of their lack of association with people that they used to associate with. But you get strong when you and I associate people that foster strength. Then there are those in that same stage of spiritual maturity. He says they are also the source of their strength and the source of their success is the scripture, the word of God. He says the word of God abides in you, lives in you. It's one thing to intellectually assent to the Word of God, and some do, some will, but there's another thing when your intellectual assenting moves to the application in your emotions and your volition so that you will not just say the Word of God, but you'll start showing the Word of God out of your life. The Word abides in you. I think it was either Charles Haddon Spurgeon or John Moody that said the Word of God ought to be so full in the child of God that if they cut us, we should bleed biblically. <laughs> well, I do know this, that if you are growing, you want the Word of God to live in you so that Christ can live through you, so that you may be useful for the kingdom of God and for you being a child of God. Deuces, I'm out. Till next time.